Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing all good today. So I had a vision in my mind that I want to dip into some purple, pastel, pastel purple and pink, yeah. So with that, I've chosen my palettes such as the Jawbreaker, Jeffree Star. I think there's some beautiful pastel shades in here. I wanna dip into Gumdrop and Bubblegum just there and I kind of want to use it in conjunction with an I Heart Revolution palette and that is the Cotton Candy. I think there's just one shade I want to use in here. I haven't decided which one yet though but when I first tested this out I remember how much I liked it. It's really nice and soft. So yeah I'm just gonna go straight into the video today. You can join in if you'd like to do your makeup with me but before we get into the video do hit subscribe if you love all things beauty and makeup and yeah without further ado let's get into some makeup. So it's been a very long time since I've been in this palette. I'm going to start off with the bubblegum shade. I'm going to put that in the inner corner. So I'm just going to put this around this area. Love how bright that is. I kind of want it a bit lighter though, like a bit pale. The shade so i might take a more fluffy brush let's go in this one this is the zoeva 227 let's see what shades there is in cotton candy right there's a shade called so sweet which is a light pink i don't think it's a shimmer no it's quite powdery but i'm gonna put that over the shade just make it a bit lighter like that so I want to put a pastel lilac, but I kind of want to make it blue, like the same tap, the same tone as my top, hopefully. So I will go into Gumdrop and a bit of Brain Freeze, just to mix those two together. And it's made like that colour, so that kind of goes on my top. And I'm just going to put this on the outer corner. Bring that pink shade up into the crease here. There we go. Okay, so for my brow highlight, I want to go into Fairy Floss. Just that shade. This smells so good. And I'm just going to put that here. Right on the brow bone so you can see that. I want to go in with two shades in the Cotton Candy. Confection and topped so mix those two together and let's just see what it looks like in the middle I think I'll use my finger for this it might be a bit better yeah for my lash line I'm just gonna repeat what I did on top Like that, okay. So now I'm gonna go in with a liner. So what liner shall I go in? I don't think I want a wing, I just want a black line. I think I will take my fat liner by Ico and just go on the lid. Then I'm going to go in my, oh, what's this? Rimmel London Soft Eyeliner Pen. I'll just go with this one now. And I'll just go in the waterline. Right, I'm just going to hop off camera to quick up the process of doing the other eye. I might put some lashes on. And yeah, be right back. So I've just done my lashes. I ended up choosing the Unicorn lashes insta famous these ones the side went on a bit dodge but we'll just carry on so for my primer i'm going to use the onyx primer revolution i absolutely hate this um applicator i just wish it was a bit easier to apply I always hate how this looks, <laughs> but 
gotta trust how we do it. So foundation, I'm gonna go in the CRT London Extraordinary and LA Girl Pro Mixing Foundation Pigment. Use those two together. I'm just going to take my Last Imperfection Concealer in the shade for number 5. I'm going to go with my Hoola Benefit just to contour. I'm gonna go in the Revolution Splendor Matte Glow Bronzer just to warm up my face. I'm gonna go in my Made by Mitchell blush. This is in the shade Peach Sugar. Okay, so for highlights, I'm going to go in my imagination. I'm going to take Angel Face. I forgot how nice this highlighter is. Then over that, I don't know why, but I kind of want to go in Graceful Glow. This is the Beauty Bay Living My Best Light Highlighting Kit. It's got like a bit of a glitter. Yeah. There we go. Here are the eyes looking so far. What shall I do for lips? I think I want to just stick with a pinky nude lip. With the lip liner, I'm going to go in the MAC Sour Shade, this lip pencil, and then over it, I'm just going to go in the Focular Lips. Uh, this is a matte lipstick, but it's in the shade Old Rose. And then because this is a matte, I want to go in a gloss. So I'll then go in the Primark Floral Days lip gloss in the shade. Rose, eh? Rose. A shade rose. Let's try that. And then go into this shade. This is more pink. The floral days. This makes it a bit lighter as well. I didn't actually plan to do a colourful look, but I thought we haven't done one in a while, so yeah. <laughs> so I've just realised I completely forgot to do the inner corner highlight, so I won't put too much, but I'm going to use the top. I'm just going to use the top shade, what we used in the middle, and just put it in there. There we go, and we should be, we should be done. So guys, here's the completed makeup using the Jawbreaking Cotton Candy. I really had fun playing with these palettes again. It was a nice throwback. Yeah, I really like these two shades together. I liked how I dipped into Gumdrop and Brain Freeze together to create the same cut as my top. I think that looked nice, and I really love this bubblegum pink. So nice. And I think Cotton Candy has some beautiful shimmers in there as well. So we use Confection and Topped. Those two together look really nice as a shimmer. Yeah, I really want to do a video using this palette on its own, the Cotton Candy, because I really had fun playing with those two shimmers. And we also used Fairy Floss as well on the brow bone. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Do let me know in the comments what other palettes you want me to try out. I do a lot of makeup looks using iHeart Revolution palettes as well, so if that's something you're interested in, do hit subscribe button down below. And yeah, give this video a thumbs up if you like it, of course. It sure helps my channel out. I shall see you in the next one. Bye!